for the, the book I'm working on. <clears throat> These are some tarot cards I just picked up today. I'm gonna be uh, having these available with the new pen. Um, but this is to promote the book. On the back it has the tag for the page on Instagram. And this character's name is Jacko. He's kind of like a, you know, college mascot, NFL mascot, those big suits. He's kind of the uh, mascot for the gas station in my story, uh, Jacko's Gas Station. And <clears throat> this is the logo right here. So imagine uh, Jacko's would be like Bucky's. If you went to Bucky's, and it was Halloween themed, you know, uh, you walk in Bucky's, it would have uh, Halloween themed snacks, candies, food items, clothing, uh, especially they'll have mask in there. Um, this is a story I wrote about eight years ago, maybe nine years ago. Um, I've went back, went back and, um, I've created a lot more to the universe of this story. And it's pretty, it's pretty exciting and um, interesting. I have a ton of like cool characters in it. <clears throat> um, I got these pins in today. It's the Jacko head. I'll be putting that on the website. But um, back to the story. I kind of explained to people, I explained to Noof and other people close to me. Um, if you ever watch the movie Clerks, it has like movies, the hamburger place. <clears throat> it would be like Clerks, movies, vibe, um, mixed with like, there's elements of like a character kind of like Ghostface from Scream that disappears and whatnot. Um, but the story's all realistic. Everything that happens in this, in this story there's nothing fantasy or fake or no uh, creatures or killers like that come back to life. Like it's a 100% it's a real scenario, but with some cool characters. Um, because I don't like movies and, and stories that never end and continue. And it's like we're on the 80th Michael Myers movie. <laughs> he got killed a million times. Uh, so this is a real, and um, the artwork for it, I started off uh, drawing and, and kind of collaging with different elements of stuff. And as I'm moving along, I start figuring out crazier ways to mix stuff up. And not only am I drawing using uh, Photoshop Illustrator, AI, uh, pictures of stuff I find. I'm, it, it's just like my brand, like the gumbo soul. I'm taking all these things in the pot, mixing it up. And when you open the book, you get, that's, that's your plate I'm serving you, you know? Um, so I, I'm really excited about releasing that. Today, I went to the, 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 the printers and these covers I'm going to have on the books going to be like embossed with uh, foil and just gel and just crazy shit on the cover. Um, it's going to take me a while to finish the book, but in the meantime, I'm kind of like uh, teasing it and posting fun images uh, about it, about the characters and about the story on Instagram. Uh, at Jacko's Gaz and Gifts. <clears throat> so if you follow along there, you can kind of get a visual and read the captions on what's going on. And by the time this book finally releases, everybody's gonna be already uh, invested into the story and the characters. So that's how I like to do things. I like to uh, build it up, <clears throat> promote the characters, and, and build a, a nice fan base for it. And this is gonna be my first actual uh, full story that I do uh, writing and illustrating and, and 
changed everything on my own. 